the first Mitsubishi Space Jet M90 in the design's final certifiable configuration flew for the first time on March 18th. Captained by flight test pilot Hiroshi Takase, flight test vehicle 10 took off at 14.53 Japan Standard Time from Nagoya Airport in Japan and performed basic performance tests in normal operating conditions over the Pacific Ocean. The aircraft returned to Nagoya some two hours later, landing at 16.40. Completion of FTV-10's first flight marks the start of the final phase of certification flight testing for the M90 the larger of two space jet regional jets under development by Mitsubishi. Mitsubishi Aircraft plans to continue flight tests on FTV-10 in Nagoya over the coming weeks, in preparation for a ferry flight to Moses Lake Flight Test Center in Washington State to join the remainder of the Mitsubishi Space Jet M90 test fleet for the final phase of type certification flight testing. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries confirmed the sixth major delay to the M90 program. Acknowledging that it would not complete type certification of the new narrowbody this year as previously planned. A company spokesperson told AIN that the decision to further push back type certification followed multiple additional design changes to the 88 seat aircraft. In January 2017, Mitsubishi delayed first delivery of the aircraft, then designated the MRJ 90 from mid 2018 to mid 2020 due to revisions to certain systems and electrical configurations to meet the latest certification requirements. At that point, a revised mid 2020 target date would have meant that the airliner had fallen seven years behind the original service entry date set at a program launch in 2008. In June 2019, Mitsubishi redesignated the 76 seat MRJ 70 the M100 and the 88 seat MRJ 90 as the M90, at the same time adopting the Space Jet brand name. The M100 model meets the 86,000 pound maximum takeoff weight threshold to comply with the US Pilot Union's scope clause agreements. Japan's All Nippon Airways remains the program's launch customer. Thanks for watching this AIN video. Please like, subscribe, and share it if you've enjoyed it. Also, visit AINonline.com for all the latest on the aviation industry.